I can't wait until I'm in my 40s. Khloe Kardashian, 39, revealed that she can't wait to move on from her worst decade ever. Khloe Kardashian exclaimed, I can't wait to be 40. Saturday after celebrating his 39th birthday earlier this week. The reality star revealed, whispering to one of her cards in her Insta stories, I hate being 30. I think it's the worst decade ever. My 30s include their benefits, like the arrival of her kids, yeah, 5-year-olds, and Tatum, who's going to complete this. The month. However, this decade also saw Chloe finalize a sensational divorce from Lamar Odom, who nearly died of a drug overdose in a brothel during the split. Next, she had a romance with Tristan Thompson, who bore her two children, but was also unfaithful to her. Chloe turned 25 in 2009 when she walked down the aisle with Lamar, a month to the day they met. The couple released a joint fragrance called Unbreakable Bond, which was rocked by their infidelity until they filed for divorce in 2013 at the age of 29. Her divorce proceedings are still in progress as she is 30 years old and celebrates her important birthday with her family on a yacht. In 2015, Lamar was found unconscious in a Las Vegas brothel after a drug overdose, then slipped into a coma, but miraculously survived the ordeal despite suffering multiple heart attacks, strokes, and kidney failure. Chloe and Lamar were still working on their divorce when the overdose happened, but she rushed to his bed anyway. She even withdrew her divorce petition, but only to legally allow her to make decisions on his behalf when he became incapacitated. They finally ended the split in December 2016, just months after Chloe called to congratulate her on her 32nd birthday. Chloe and Tristan dated on and off from 2016 to 2021, though their relationship fractured due to the athlete's ongoing cheating scandals. Less than 48 hours before True was born, DailyMail.com exclusively broke down Tristan's alleged affair with New York strip club bartender Lonnie Blair. He and Chloe were still together at the time, but they broke up in 2019 after Tristan kissed at a party with Kylie Jenner's BFF Jordan Woods. During the coronavirus lockdown, Tristan and Chloe move in together so they can be with True while rekindling their romance. Reports of their latest breakup began to circulate in June 2021 when Tristan found himself denying the whirlwind of rumors about his fidelity. Then, DailyMail.com exclusively obtained court documents in late 2021 that claimed Tristan has a child with Marilee. Marali gave birth on December 1 and made a statement a few weeks later with the first public photos of her son. Tristan took to Instagram in January 2022 and admitted for the first time that he is the father of baby girl Marilee after verifying the truth through a paternity test. Chloe vented her anger against her ex during the season 1 finale of The Kardashians, which aired last June, after hearing about Tristan and Marley's baby. She made Tristan's shocking discovery when her sister, Kim Kardashian, read a story on DailyMail.com that exclusively broke the news of the former NBA player, admitting to being the father of a child in court documents. Chloe was seen crying as she lashed out at Tristan for humiliating her with yet another public scandal. I called him and said, what do you have to say? For my part, I yelled some more, but he, speaking, tried to plead his case. There's not much I can say in my opinion, Chloe said later in the episode. It's a joke, it's rude, it's a joke, it's embarrassing, it sucks, we're all over the place. I was like, I didn't buy tickets to this goddamn circus, but somehow I'm watching all these clowns perform in front of me. To participate in this show. Somehow the clowns got back into this goddamn clown car, and no matter what he says, nothing will give me the answer I'm looking for. The end Chloe first became involved with Tristan when his ex-girlfriend Jordan Craig was still pregnant with their eldest son, Prince, who is six years old. Although Jordan claims she was still with Tristan when he met Chloe, the reality star insists she thought he was celibate at the